Mommy? Daddy? Ethan? Oh god. This is looking inviting. Please, go away! Mom! Dad! Oh shit. Maybe jump a little. Okay, enough of that. I can't turn it. It won't open! Oh! Whoa! Are you gonna blow up too? The fucking three's like upside sideways. No. Oh my god. Daddy! Mommy! Where are you? Claire, sweetie. Everything is gonna be okay. Go back in. Uh, um, no. What was that? No. Please help me. Please help me. I have no idea what voice I should be doing. I don't want to walk into it, but I feel like I have to. Uh, help yourself. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. Okay, you're going to repeat. Oh god. Whoa! Can I move? What is this thing? Let go of me! Damn button. Oh, what's that sound? Annie! It's the monster again! We can hide in that cabinet! Oh my god, what is that? What was that? Hide in closets and other objects by interacting with them. Thank you, narrator man voice. Whoa! Can you? Who's like that? Oh, that is fucking weird. Wait, so are you fist fucking me? I have to fight my way through these things again? Like, you know how you're supposed to run away from the scary things that you can't fight back against? Well, it's just. Dick, I'm in your way. Maybe if I just run really fast. Okay. Using your head, Michael. Using your head. It's amazing what happens when you actually do that. Responding. What the fuck am I supposed to do? I'm drowning. Oh, righty then. Oh, no shit. I forgot that's a button I can use. 
Esteban's over here yelling at me, you're supposed to jump through the doors, and I'm just like, oh, yeah, just like how I forgot I can run. A bunch of prescription meds. <coughs> Health restored. I love other dogs like you, drug addict. When I said take them, I didn't mean pop them. I meant like, put them in your pocket, they might be needed for a quest later. Hey, you know, semantics. Run it and gun it. Are you fucking kidding me? Toro, Toro! Come here, you creepy bastard. Or that works too. This is embarrassing, but I can't remember their faces. I... Don't fret, dear. I'll find it. I'd like to help you look. That's very kind of you. Tell me about your children. I almost did that in the old lady's voice, like, Creepy? Oh, you're, you're old enough to pop them out. Mm. Well, there was... Uh, there was... Uh... Oh, shh. Annie. Be lining past these motherfuckers. Come get me, mother licker. Come on, Greg. I'm already not sure if I'm okay with this. There's like... Fetuses in a jar? Like, God, what the fuck is that? Oh, there's a door. I thought it was a sign. I was like, yay, more lore! I was like, no. No, Mr. Lore, no. God damn it. Ooh, buddy, I am not looking forward to hitting X on this door. If anything out of years of playing horror games has taught me anything, the morgue is not my happy place. It never has, nor will... Oh, whoa, that was weird. Watch, let's let her step for a minute. So do the thing again, Claire. Do the thing. Yeah, she like curls up and puts her hoodie on. Aww. And she takes a nap. And then things from darkness eat her. I bet Claire would be hot in 3D rendering. Hashtag still single ladies. Which confirms the fact that Claire is clearly past the high school years, therefore I'm legally allowed to hit on her little character sprite. I'm gonna have to start blowing through health items because I'm not dying enough. This is a new one for me. Yeah, that's over right there. Oh, time to explore the bathtoriums. Hello? No, I ain't fucking sticking around. Well, something exploded in here. Gross! That is some explosive diarrhea! <laughs> oh, hot. These ones are cute. These ones aren't. We all are guards or something. <laughs> No, y'all are just dicks. Just teasing me. Oh, what the hell? What? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Uh. 
Well, let's just go into the vagina in the wall. Okay. Save point. Okay. Getting weirder, but I think we're getting close to the end. I'm feeling it. I feel it deep, deep down in my loins. Right next to my tightening butthole, because this game is freaking me the fuck out, and I am probably going to have the weirdest fucking dreams tonight. Okay, horror genre. I get it. Weird, pulsating things are creepy. But why? Why must it always be a vagina? Answer me that. All of horror, not just video games. Movies. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm getting freaking out. I'm freaking out. Oh, lord. Well, this can't be a happy sign. And they aren't coming after me. That's the funny thing, though. These without faces, I think they're all the dead students from the fire. What is this? It's time, Claire. You've had your time. What's left is no longer your concern. I don't understand. It's time you did. Bright lights. You missed it when I post episode one. You're gonna shit your britches. What the hell? Hello, Claire. What? What is this? Where am I? You are here. What, what kind of answer is that? Where is here? That depends on you. What do you mean? Who are you? You don't recognize me? I... I hope it's not too... Oh, it's her dad. I hope it's not too late for that dance. No. No! You don't get to say that! Claire, I... No, Dad! You abandoned me! I needed you! And you abandoned me! What kind of person forces a little girl to take care of her brain-dead mother? You robbed me of my childhood! I need to back off a little bit. Claire... God knows I have a lot to answer for, but I didn't abandon you. Not on purpose. Oh, really? I would love to hear your excuse. You don't remember, do you? Remember what? I was taken from you. So, what? You're dead? Yes. <laughs> you actually expect me to believe that? To be honest, I don't know what to expect. Well, there wasn't much of a difference in your parenting style, dead or alive. Uh. Dude, this game is dark as fuck. Just, Janet, it's dark as fuck. I love the shit out of this. I've been re I've been comparing it to Silent Hill. I know. You need to know that I loved you and your brother more than anything in the world. You. Claire, let me finish. I thought I could shield you from my demons. But when I missed your dance, I realized that was impossible. I saw what I did to you. No father should hurt his daughter like that. I decided to get clean, but I was too late. There was other collateral damage. What do you want from me, Dad? I don't know. 
You have no idea how badly I just want to hug you and beg for forgiveness. But I don't think. Realistically, I just want you to know that given another chance, I would have been a good father. You and Ethan were the only things that should have ever mattered. It took me a long time to figure that out. But wandering here for a long time can clear your head. If you let it. What do you mean, a long time? My journey here took longer than yours. Where is here? Like I said before, it depends on you. I don't know what the darkest dungeon is. Now it's just getting super meta. Like at first it was just weird, creepy flashbacks, like I change ages. Oh god, my character's dead. I don't understand. Help me. I can't make you understand, Claire. Things don't make sense. If you're dead, then how come I'm just finding out now? Someone would have said something. You're right. Keep thinking. I am trying. You said there was other collateral damage. Claire, your hand. It's bleeding. How did I cut it? Wait. I woke up with it bandaged in the nurse's office, but I don't remember cutting it. Ethan, the picture! Dad, Ethan, Ethan is dead too, isn't he? Yes. Dad, how did you and Ethan die? Like I said, my demons affected more than just my children. No! Claire, now is the time to ask yourself, do I deserve to be here? What did I do? I don't know. Only you know the truth. It's time to break down the barriers. I don't know what I did. I want to remember, I swear. Wait. You don't deserve to be here. You would do anything to get out. I have no idea if that's still bad. That's not true. No, definitely not going down. But it is. I am you. And you know you be better. You better than this. Dad, help! Ha <laughs> ha.